our existing infrastructure, county governments save resources that would have gone to erecting poles, digging up of trenches for wiring, regular maintenance due to vandalism and being knocked down by motorists, allowing them to channel the resources to other critical areas such as education, health and roads. By allowing Kenya Power to erect and maintain streetlights for them, county governments can focus on other critical services, hence enhancing efficiency in service delivery. Kenya Power has also been involved in lighting up residential areas, especially in formal areas such as Kibira and Mukuru Kwanjenga. This has not only enhanced security, but also allowed local business operators to run their businesses into the night. <laughs> And we are going to roll this to the entire, you know, other counties in the country. Already we are doing this in Kachiado. The county government of Bomet have already bought 500 LED lights for installation by KPSC. So this is spreading across the countries. In recognizing the challenges faced by residents of informal settlements, Kenya Power approached the World Bank and obtained funding through the Global Partnership on Output-Based Aid, GIPOVA. This funding has enabled Kenya Power to provide safe, clean and affordable power to residents of informal settlements. We are going to connect as many, I'm told, as 50,000 Kenyans within this particular community. And we shall be giving them prepaid metering. Prepaid meters will assist them to manage their consumption. The residents pay a minimum fee of 1,200 shillings, while the World Bank pays 19,000 shillings and Kenya Power, 11,000 shillings. The informal settlements covered so far include Kibira and Mukuru Kayaba in Nairobi County, Kachonjo in Mombasa County, Marachi in Busia County, Obunga, Nyalenda, Kaluleni and Bandani in Kisumu County, Amalemba in Kakamega County, Kiumba in Rusinga Island, Bondeni in Nakuru County, Wetevie Village in Nyandara County, among others. The GPOBA project has enabled Kenya Power to reduce the number of deaths due to illegal and unsafe connections, provide lighting that has enabled school children to study longer, and improve on health by reducing the use of kerosene lamps known to cause respiratory problems. Power, powering people for better lives.